We begin tonight with breaking news. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brandy Cummings. Three women are hurt and a man is dead after a shooting in Norfolk. Police say it all unfolded at the intersection of Church Street and Princess Anne Road around 745. Many calls came into the Wavy newsroom. Ten on your side's Kara Dixon is now live at the scene. And Kara, you spoke to police an hour ago. What else have you learned? Brandy, I'm still out here at church scene where the police are still investigating that shooting that left one man dead. Now, if you can look behind me, you can see police officers are still out here. And that is where that man died. Now, police say he died after he was killed when multiple vehicles shot at each other at the intersection here at church and Princess Anne. Now, when officers arrived, they found that man dead inside of a white car here on Church Street. That car ended up crashing into an apartment complex. No one was injured inside the building, but after doing a canvas search, of the area, police found three other victims, all women. They were taken to the Centaur Norfolk General Hospital, where one is in critical condition. The other two, which includes a 17 year old woman, are in stable condition. We spoke with people who gathered at the scene. They described hearing the shooting as sounding like a thunderstorm with at least 15 shots fired. This is a residential neighborhood, and police say they're thankful no one else was struck by the bullets. Now they're counting on the community for help to find who did this. Leads that have surfaced within the immediate crime scene were obviously pursuing. This case just happened hours ago, so it's still in the infancy stages. However, we are asking people to dial 1888 um, Lock You Up for crime line tips. Now, again, if you know anything about this shooting, you are asked to call the crime line at 1 888 Lock You Up, and we'll continue to work to learn more about these victims and more about the shooting as it continues to develop, and we will t update you all on this story. Reporting live in Norfolk, Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.